Welcome back, everyone. Crummy Literature here. Time for some more Project Zomboids. So we're going to go into Fashion Store here. But I think we might actually go into the buffet and go around the back. Because this little group of zombies here is making me uncomfortable. Assuming we can get in. And we can. <laughs> Probably should have closed the door behind me, but oh well. This has the added benefit of getting us some access to the f kitchen in here. His des desert boots keep make making me think that he is um, not wearing any shoes. <laughs> Take the duct tape. I don't really think I need the crowbar. A couple of nails. Random shotgun shells, sure. Still don't actually have a shotgun to go with those shells, but someday we will. Honey. Various liquids. Although we're actually pretty much out of space here. So let's get our... Let's also eat this burger since it is now defrosted. So one second, I want to raise the volume of my headphones. Just a scooch. Alright. Shouldn't affect your volume at all, but... A little bit for mine. Alright, school bag. That secondary. That dangled to the side. Pork chop. Ice cream. You scream. I'm gonna eat that whole thing even though it's gonna make us absolutely stuffed. Just because I don't want to carry it home. This might melt on the way. Nobody wants melted ice cream. Alright, so is this outside? Or is this a back hallway? This is outside. I don't think there's another door, so maybe we can't get in this way. We'll have to just deal with the slightly scary number of zombies over here. Oh, they shifted further away. Thank you, zombies. That's very considerate of you. There are zombies in this building, though. Come here. Make sure the other group didn't hear us. Now this might end up being useless. Oh, hello. I looked to... Glanced off the screen there for a second to make sure things were working. And almost had a tragedy. I'll take the lighter. So this, this place may end up being useless, but it, I feel like it's worth a look-see for potentially a bag or unusual clothing. Red. Low on water, apparently. Fingerless gloves, leather gloves. Those on. See, it's already benefiting us. Mannequins show up as just things, huh? Okay, right, it's fine. Kind of like to. We could take some mannequins home with us so we can uh, display clothing we're not going to wear. Some sort of TV or something nearby. That diamond patterned sweater I think is good for the... It's probably upstairs now that I think about it. Um is good for the winter time, but eh, chances of us surviving that long, <laughs> pretty low. And if we did, we'll have plenty of time to find stuff in the future. All right, let's go to the bookstore. Actually, you know what I want to do is get up, see if we can get upstairs. No, of course not. I really wanted to get near that TV so we could see what was on it. Oh, there's a zombie in here. Hey, we're actually within range of the advanced carpentry. Let's see if we can hear it. 
I'm gonna guess this is probably not enough uh, details to get the benefit. Just too bad. <laughs> We're missing a TV show, which is always annoying. Already have first aid and cooking is cooking is irrelevant at this point. I think we have metal work for beginners. Just read these magazines. I was skipping them because I thought we'd get them later, but at this point it just seems like we should just clear them from our inventory so we don't have to worry about them again in the future. Twitchy as well. Read. And we'll toss this one. Red, 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 red. Yeah. Just making sure we didn't miss any of those when we were looking around. Because sometimes the uh, the queuing up of stuff does not work the best. It's really a shame that we missed that. I hate missing TV shows. It's just free skill points that you don't get another shot at if you miss them. I'm not gonna take anything above intermediate. Because we're a long way off from that. Forging for beginners, I'll take. We might have that book already. I'll work for intermediates. Unlikely to come to pass, but we'll take it anyways. Two more to check. We're done. We done here. Medical is where we came. Hey, duffel bag. Thanks for the duffel bag, person. Appreciate it. This is better than our second bag here that we have. As soon as this guy dies, anyways. Thank you. Stuff it in there for the moment. Kind of in a dangerous place for us to be, uh, Move an inventory around. <laughs> Goes upstairs, right? Yeah. There cuts in more. I don't, can't think. Oh, aside from maybe scissors or tailoring, can't think of anything that's useful in there. Just gonna eat this cookie. More cigarettes. Well, we have so many cigarettes right now. I should probably take the pop too, but I'm on a little bit of a size crunch right now, so I don't want to take everything. Take that bad boy. Take the lighter. You know, we should actually, we, we need a uh, liquid, so let's actually just drink one of these. Where'd you go? There you are. can. I wish there was a way to tell it, like, drop used cans, you know? In Cataclysm they have something like that where you can set it so that it drops used up containers so you don't carry around a bunch of empty containers. Not gonna bother with that watermelon right now. We want to get some arcade Machines for the house, we can get them from here. Is it outside? Yeah, more or less. Hammer, flashlight. Excuse me, a hand torch. Oh, there's a key to one of those cars outside.
This is back of... Oh, this is the hair cutting place. Yeah, there's the scissors. All right, I will take one pair of scissors. Some hair dye if we want to do that. Our walkie talkie because we should disassemble that at some point. It's a toolbox. Mallet. Toolboxes are, you know, kind of helpful because you can put all your tools in one place and then you have like, this is what I grab when I'm going to do carpentry work. But that sounds way too organized for me. Any good in the trash? Hey, trash candy. Love me some trash candy. Alright, let's head home. Is it this car? What's this car? Okay, let's uh kill this zombie and see if this car is functional. It's broken taillight. See that. Oh no! Hand axe broke. No. No gas. Oh, I suppose I should check the stuff, huh? Are we in Rosewood? Can't remember now where I am. For some reason, I think we are in Rosewood, actually, now that I think about it. About it. Hey, a baseball bat. Thanks. For some reason for me, aside from, uh, aside from Muldraw and West Point, which are the two cities that existed when I started playing the game, well, actually I think maybe West Point got added right after I started playing the game. Well, regardless, ma the vast majority of time that I played the game. I can't keep track of the other names of the cities. This is more zombies than I really wanted to deal with before we got home, especially wielding a bat one-handed. Deal with it, we will. Nice beret. So slow. See if we can slide around him. I'm gonna guess the answer is gonna be no, especially when there's another group in the next door yard. I'd rather deal with these four than that, like, eight. You know what we're gonna do? We're going to drop this. We're going to equip this in both hands. Pick it up later. Uh-oh. We're okay. We're okay. No worries. Somebody fall, please. Thank you. I want both of you. Bits and pieces of this group are filtering towards me now. I thought there was one more. There's also one zombie here that we're almost certainly going to have to fight. Ooh. Pistol. I don't really have space for you. Guess I'll just grab you. I know I left that bag behind, by the way. I just want to kind of aggravate this zombie first. Because he's between us and the house, so he's going to have to get killed. Alright. Grab this thing. It's primary. 
We'll see if we can get home without upsetting the rest of this group. We should be okay at this point. Them shifting over mostly into the house. Or, well, I guess they're about halfway out of it. Made things easier. Do have a zombie right here, though. We thread the needle. Do a little sneaking here. No, he saw us. Immediately pats around the fence, goes the fence. The zombies are too smart, man. And dead. That group is shifting away from us, which is good. I heard a zombie there for a second. Did I hear a zombie? Seems to be okay. Let's unload all the food. Thing came up surprisingly light on food there. For all the stuff we grabbed, nearly as much food as you would expect. Oh, that definitely needs to go in the freezer. I'm just gonna eat this banana. A lot of books. Going over here to put the books away. Okay. Just need to just dump everything in our in our everything drawer because that's how I roll. Why be organized? We can just put everything in one spot. All the soap. Duct tape I don't need right now. Need three bottles of disinfectant. Need five things of beta blockers. Mallet there. I need to drop, I'll throw the double bag on the ground for a second. away we have a hand axe that's in almost good condition almost perfect condition I should say it is in good condition Take this the rest of the cereal we're trying to undo our um, underweight trait so that's why I'm being a little bit more cavalier with her food than I probably would be otherwise. Magazine and that pistol. I guess put it in the holster. Don't even know if it's really worth it, but I'll do it anyways. I don't think I'm going to carry the baseball bat right now. Just stick with what we got. it all down. Alright, fill the pop bottle. Fill the water bottle. Nice. Alright. I need to put actually get away put away the um school bag. Don't need you anymore. I guess I didn't really need to throw the duffel bag on the ground because I'm just gonna put it in here for now. Come on. Oh, looking in the wrong place. There we go. 
All right, let's watch TV. Did we miss it? Shouldn't, oh, there it is. I was gonna say we shouldn't have missed it. No, it was pretty good if I thought about turning all the TVs off in the area. Apparently we missed it. We only got one skill up from that. Means there's probably a TV on around somewhere nearby that set us off. It's weird. I don't know where it is. I don't feel like we're close enough. Maybe we are still close enough to downtown to have it trigger. Well, we at least got a little spit skill up from that. Well, right here in the middle of the T floor, we're going to put Spiffo down. Spiffo needs a 3D model. So carrying more than I should. Probably don't need all these alcohol wipes. Or like a big chunk of these nails. Nails don't really weigh much of anything, but they do weigh something. That's better. Smoke a cigarette, because I'm sure we're getting close there. There's a available board that I can grab somewhere. Let's check nearby. Actually, you know what? Let me grab the sledgehammer and we'll break into that garage. That was massively overweight. And it's heavy. Not majorly heavy. I hear a zombie somewhere. Right, uh. That was weird. I think the animation's triggered in a weird way there. Is there somebody else? And a generator. Nice surprise to be right here. Blood pipe's not in good shape. Don't bother with it. Trowel, some broccoli seeds. All in all, not the greatest, but uh, the generator makes that all worthwhile. Some more cars to check out. What's up north? Oh, the up north is like um, is a doctor's office, maybe a law office. I always kind of remember that one because I, I played a game with the survivors mod turned on. Once and there was a crazy lawyer. I think he was a lawyer up there that was shooting at everybody and didn't want to be my friend. And eventually he died. But those are things we'll check out tomorrow. For now, thanks so much for joining me. I am as always the Criminal Archer, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks so much.